Hello, my name is Muhammad Ahal. I'm the integration support engineer here at Mamo, and today I'm going to show you how to install our Mamo application to your Shopify store in under five minutes. First, we need to go to the Shopify app store to, to get the Mamo application. We can do so by going to our dashboard, then developer, then scroll down, and we're going to see Shopify as one of our extensions. We're going to, we're going to go ahead and open Shopify in a new tab. And we're gonna find it right there we simply click install this will redirect us back to our default store on shopify where we can simply click install the app and install the mamo application now after we install the application the first thing we're gonna be prompted to do is to enter our api key the api key can be found also on your mamo dashboard under developer here we can click copy key to simply copy it and paste it there or we can simply keep it for now empty uh, for testing purposes. So once we click submit, this will redirect us back to our store settings with the payments. As we can see, Mamo is now installed. All we have to do is configure it before activating it. Uh, we can add our API keys whenever we want by clicking manage. This will redirect us back to that API key page. We can allow or forbid one of these card types and we can enable and disable test mode. After doing so, we can simply click activate to activate the plugin. Now that this, it is activated, I should be able to see Mamo as well as one of my payment gateways when I'm buying something off my store. Let's say for example, this store. I'm gonna go ahead and buy one of these notebooks. As you can see, Mamo is listed under payment as one of the payment gateways. Once I click pay now, I'm going to be redirected to Mamo's uh, payments page, where I will be prompted to enter my card and to complete my payment. The, the email and the card holder name are already pre-filled from the billing address and billing details. Once I enter my card, I can simply click pay now, and this will execute the payment. Once the payment is done, I'm going to be redirected back to the store with my order summary and the continue shopping box. And here you go. As simple as that. Once I'm, the, I'm done with my testing and I'm confident enough, I can come to my manual dashboard, copy my API key, go to my settings, manage, paste my key here, simply click submit and disable test mode in my settings. This will take my website live and I'll be able to make live payments. And if you have any questions or inquiries, please feel free to reach out to us on our support portals via chat or email. Thank you and good luck.